In this short lesson, I'm going to show you how to organize your clips by making bins, which are just folders to put your clips in or other assets, so it's easier for you to find things when looking for them in the browser. Since I finished logging the rest of the tape, I have a lot of clips in the browser, and my sequence, which says sequence one, is buried within those clips. So I want to put those clips in a folder, which we call bins, so that I don't have to scroll through all of my clips or other assets to find something in the browser. So I'm going to go to File on the top menu, New, and then Bin. A folder appears in my browser window, and I'm going to name this bin Media. Then I'm going to highlight all of my clips and drag them into this Media bin. So I highlight a bunch of clips by making a lasso around them. Then I grab one of the icons, hold it on the Media bin. When it lights up, I let it go. All those clips go into that bin. Once I'm done, there will only be the Media folder in my browser and the sequence. My sequence is the timeline that I currently have active. Notice that the name of the sequence 1 in your browser is the same as the tab in your timeline. I'm going to go ahead and change this to Master Cut 1 so that my sequence has a unique name. Notice that when I change the name of the sequence in the browser, it also changes in the tab of the timeline. You can make as many bins and sequences as you want and rename them as you need as your project develops. Now we're ready to start putting clips into our timeline and start editing.